Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's guy Rez, and I am back again with y'all for another dope jersey video. Welcome. So in this video right here, I just wanted to share with you guys a quick unboxing that I got in the mail today. Shout outs to eBay for always having some really great deals and steals and finds and all that stuff, man. There's always that drive, man, that, that urge that I have when I'm searching and hunting for stuff on eBay. The thrill of it, man. So I just want to share this jersey pickup with you guys because uh, honestly, I've been getting kind of into this uh, phase right now of this current style jersey and just lying right quick. So anyways, you know, without further ado, guys, I'm going to do an unboxing with y'all. And like I said in previous unboxing videos, guys, be careful with these. They're very sharp. Also, it is a good sign, I must say, whenever you get a jersey that is shipped in a box, man. You already know that the jersey is most likely going to be packed very, very well. And of course, shout outs to the seller for shipping a jersey in a pack and in a box, man. That is super safe, super secure, man. So salute to y'all. Opening up this jersey. Damn, they triple packed it. Look at that. A box in a bag and in like the gift wrap paper yo this is ebay brand too man i gotta look this up man it says thank you for supporting my small business you gotta love that man you just got to love that kind of business man and just that overall customer service satisfaction i love it taking this off and whoo -hoo, i'm taking this back guys because this jersey right here man you know uh shout outs to this team by the way uh for Really putting up a valiant effort against the Dodgers, man. Um, they lost, unfortunately. They got eliminated in the wild card this year. But, yo, <laughs> I'm definitely going back in the 2000s with this joint right here, guys. This jersey right here, guys, I'm not going to lie. I'm going through a phase right now where I'm trying to find some, like, really old, uh, older style jerseys from, like, the 2000s era, man. But, yo, this right here, this is of the St. Louis Cardinals. Uh, but this is actually from the G3 and Carl Banks line right here. This is a collab. For those of you who are wondering, G3 and Carl Banks, they did a collab where they pretty much do like lifestyle fashion type jerseys. This is not an actual jersey that the players wore on, you know, the baseball field and stuff like that. But I like it because you're still able to rep the teams and your team if you're a Cardinals fan. And just overall the jersey, man. This is a dope jersey to me, man. And um, yeah, dude, this is just an excellent piece for me to add to my collection. So I know a lot of you guys are probably wondering like, yo, Rez, like what the hell, man? Like what's the deal with this? Why are you going through this phase? So real quick. <laughs> so for those of you who don't know, and I'm going to put this out there. So take notes guys, if I ever quiz you, but a big portion of why I got into the Jersey game is because of a wrestler. And for those of you who follow me, for you know over the years since i started doing videos like almost 12 years ago on youtube man uh john cena aka the doctor of thugonomics in the beginning man like back in the 2000s era early 2000s he started to to come out you know rocking the throwback jerseys and this was actually a jersey that he wore so uh i'm kind of going through this phase right now where i'm trying to like hunt for all the jerseys that john cena wore back in the like 2000s era i know it's such a weird goal to try and accomplish but it's something that uh, i'm having a hell of a blast on doing and like it's something that i wanted to do before but i didn't really have the money to do it but now that i have a job and everything and now that i could actually like afford this stuff on the regular you know this is definitely something that was on my list for a while and believe it or not guys these jerseys are actually quite hard to find in my size and also in great condition like there are a couple of these that have popped up um in the last like few months and years on ebay but like the condition was not so great and this one was actually probably the best condition that i saw online so i definitely had to pull the trigger on this one right here but anyways guys let me just go into the detail right quick and give you a close look you know it's got this like uh velour type like towel material as you can see a lot of like jerseys from the 2000s era had this you know this is just kind of the style and this by the way guys these jerseys do run quite big so you know don't think like these jerseys are going to fit like today's like mitchell and ness you know swingmans or like the nike stuff these are actually much bigger so to be honest with you like an xl this is an xl but this probably fits more like a 2x in today's standards but i really like this design right here i felt like the cardinals always had one of the dopest designs in the mlb you know this is uh reminiscent of their 1922 
up until 26 season where they actually wore the jerseys with these styles and this uh design of the cardinals right there just staring at each other on the baseball bat but as you can see that c is kind of the crescent almost looks like a moon just kind of like wrapping its uh the crescent around the baseball bat and then it says you know cardinals and uh also on the side you know you have like that red felt velour material right there and then of course on the arm sleeves of the jersey it changes color from this like baby sky blue to the red right there and then you have this patch that says world champions uh with the st louis cardinals logo and 1942 right there so this part is embroidered on you have trim on the arm sleeves right there with that red and that white also on this side you don't have a patch but you just have the plain velour material it looks pretty good like the quality is actually not bad um conditions really great considering its age this jersey is like almost i think it's like 20 plus years old man so um getting up there in age but such really really good condition let me show you guys a neck tag real quick there is a neck tag cooperstown collection by g3 and carl banks it's a size extra large guys this is made in vietnam so as you can see right there there's a neck tag then let me show you guys the jock tag right quick you see right there same thing is like on the neck tag so for those of you who are wondering what the material is it says here 80 percent cotton i'll read it to you 20 percent polyester care on reverse it says machine wash warm separately uh bleach when needed tumble dry medium so just be careful guys like this is like a towel material so definitely it's not going to be like your standard polyester jersey so you know you might want to just handle this with care when uh if you decide or if you own one of these but let me give you a full look this is pretty dope man i'm not gonna lie i gotta get like a matching fitted or a hat with this uh jersey right here but always love the cardinals jersey designs and i love their logo just with the two cardinals right there on that baseball bat it's super dope to me really really nice design really nice colors very vibrant definitely fitting you know especially with this era of when this jersey when people bought these jerseys you know they obviously uh, it was just a different time with fashion obviously this is deemed as out of style by most people but yo i don't care man i'm gonna be rocking this you know and I, like i said i'm going through like a phase right now guys so definitely uh <laughs> i'm gonna be enjoying this man and I'll, I'll definitely be standing out when i'm rocking this in public well, my final thoughts on this jersey i like it obviously i bought it for a reason but man you know i always felt like the cardinals had one of the dopest designs in the mlb man and uh i was so bummed man when they lost against the dodgers man i was really rooting for them obviously me being a giants fan i have to root against the dodgers man so uh nonetheless man you know whether they won or lost you know they have dope jerseys that's never going to change but um yeah i would definitely recommend it if you guys are into this type of style and just design anyways guys that's pretty much going to wrap it up for me please share your thoughts in the comment section below and let me know what you guys think about this st louis cardinals jersey made by g3 and carl banks you guys feel these jerseys you guys not you guys think these are whack i mean personally for me i dig them you know you don't have to but um, I definitely want to add these to my collection. I am currently on the hunt for some other ones. I'm looking for a Mariners one. Um, you know, I'm also looking for a Milwaukee Brewers one and uh, a Chicago Cubs one. So obviously, guys, if you um, find any in my size, please send them my way. And let me know what you guys think about the Cardinals design from this era. Are you guys fans of the St. Louis Cardinals? Are you not? You know, I'd love to hear what you guys think about your team. I appreciate everybody watching. Before I go, please don't forget to hit that like button on this video. Subscribe to the channel. Share the video as well. Because, you know, I'm trying to grow the channel exponentially before the end of the year, people. All right, guys, that's pretty much going to wrap it up for me. I'm going to head on out of here. But before I go, guys, let me give you one last look at this bad boy right here. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, I love it, guys. You know, uh, thanks again for watching, and I'll see y'all very soon. Your boy Rez is out. Peace!